You are no name. Today, YouTube, and welcome to another episode of the Albino Rugby Review. You have the Rhino. We have strange brew things here. We got a beer that he brought over. What the fuck is this shit? <laughs> oh, look at that! <laughs> Well, that's, cool. actually, that's really blind person friendly, too. Oh, yes, yes. yes. <laughs> I've uh, actually that green on green writing, never had right? anything by these guys, but I know what it is because of that. This is a Three Floyds beer, Zombie Dust. I can't read the ABV or anything. Oh, cool awesome. label. Dust. Cool label, dude. Yeah. That's this very cool. dehydrate the zombies, crush them up, and snort them? That's the one. Yeah. I've been to those fucking, parties. I'm, on, I'm all aboard that. Yeah. Uh, it is um, actually a I very nice label. See. Us blind guys can't find that shit. They don't typically list ABVs on their bottles, anyways. Uh, it it randomly changes. Probably like a 6.8 or I don't know, something like that. Right. Six point eight or two. Some American three. Pale Ale. It's nothing. Uh, it's nothing imperialized. Yeah. Like Alrighty. So we want to save the cap for the fridge. Bang bang bang. So I'm I'm taking it. You've had it this many a time. I've had it a few times. We can save some for everybody else. Yeah, I don't need it. <clears throat> Average Joe says 6.4 percent. Of course, Average Joe would know. I asked him. <laughs> you know the internet. Joe will never have this beer. Just, just so you know, Joe, you'll never have this beer. That's a beautiful color for a pale ale. <laughs> you might get Colgate, but you'll never get the beer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's all citrus all the time. Every she mm. switched to basically have Colgate and all mm. three. Really. Beautiful citrus smell. Lots and lots of mango. Lots of Orange, yeah, use grapefruit. Am use Amarillo in this one. I'm not sure if it's exclusively Amarillo. It, it might be. Though. It's just—it's it's like citrus <laughs> assaulting your nose. Yeah, it's beautiful. Is yeah. it? Yeah. Hey guys. <sighs> there you go. Cheerio, sir. Here, send me a switch of zombie dust. Oh yeah. Yeah, there should be enough there to go around. Well, that's beautiful. Mm. That's that pine. What are those piney? Uh, that piney one. What's that come from? Long clippings. Yes. It drinks really well. I mean, this is. No, that's the lemon ones. Oh, oh. this is like a fucking Dungeons and Dragons. Oh, I know. I told you that bottle's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I can feel my level thirteen elf coming out already. Mm. There's a nice brightening malt taste too, eh? Yeah, I find it's like that, that, that's that's. And it has a nice bitterness, but it like fades right away. Yeah. It hits the back of your throat and it's very bitter and then just gone. Yeah. Mm. There's like a lot of, I wouldn't say a lot of crystal malt in this, eh? but it's, it's got a nice little bit of sweetness to it. Too. It's hoppy, but it go, like you said, it goes right away. Yeah, it hits you with everything. That's I mean, weird. You're, you're That's why getting, I drink so nicely. You're getting the resin, but the resin doesn't last. It's just bang, gone. Yeah, yeah it doesn't give you that the, the, the cat shit in your mouth feel like that. <laughs> cat shit in your mouth? Yeah. He's already said that a couple times. <laughs> yeah, cats. Sometimes they shit in your mouth and it gives you bad fucking vibes. Uh, I have a feeling it. something with his daughter's cat has happened recently. Oh. My cat has done no such thing. It's old cat. Still. He's got the fucking cancer and the, and the fucking shakes and shit. So he's like a stink and like a, a bag of leaves that hasn't been tied mm. off. It just sort of falls. But you do get pine, pine, you do get citrus and resininess, yeah. and it just fades right away. You're right, a nice bready malt up like for, what, at the forefront, which gives a nice sweetness in the background. This is a beautiful beer. Yeah, my cat does Yeah. yeah. <laughs> One single tear. Just wish you could get it more often. That's the thing. This is it a nice. limited release? No, it's uh, it's just it's hard to get. And it's only like Chicago area, Indiana area. It's a I've been in the brewery twice. Each time I've gone, they haven't had it uh, available to buy. Really? These it's guys are fast. these guys are basically whales with all their beer. People will jump on it, gumball head. I can understand why they drink it. Uh, yeah, like this stuff just. Yeah. Slide. This beautiful. is their everyday stuff too, and they can't keep their everyday stuff in their in their brewery. It's on tap all the time. But yeah. That's incredible. Yeah. yeah, I won't say that I was just at the brewery last week and had it on tap, and it was just equally awesome. But I, I was. And, you know, I'm a humble brag. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, suck it. Joe, suck it. Joe. <laughs> <laughs> You know what I love about bringing our fans from the internet in? 
Uh, I don't really look at the internet. I know I don't that much either. <laughs> That's Chad's job. I'll watch my videos sometimes. I, That's it. I, I, know, I know these people he's talking about, but you have an entirely different relationship with all the other guys. On yeah. Oh yeah. Well, we're, I'm I'm part of the troll brigade. I mean, we sit on JTV and we just talk shit to everybody who steps up in front of the camera. You guys not really. You not. You, you guys are too good. I mean, oh, Honey Monster, Ginger, your fucking boom. Ear. When Honey Monster steps up the plate, it's like games on, baby. <laughs> Thank God he ain't here because I don't want him trolling this fucking beer either. That's because the honey monster trolls J-Date for God's sake. <laughs> I'm done on time for this. Ain't nobody got time for this. Oh. I got no time for that. I brought him a beer actually. I'll show him later. I'll show you guys later. It's a tribute beer. It's not for him. It's a tribute beer. I'd buy that all the time if I could. This Since it good. sounds like you can't, I guess it's 875, but it deserves really a higher mark. It's good. like a 9. I give it an 8. It's pretty tasty. I want to give it a nine, but because it's my show and I can make my own fucking rules, oh, I'm gonna give it an eight seven five. Non-dancing motherfucker. Yeah, I know he doesn't. And I've had a lot. I'm gonna still give it a nine five because I love it that much. Yeah, it's it's really worth a nine five because you guys. Does it deserve a zombie yeah. dance? Yeah. <laughs> Chad, give it a nine and do a zombie dance. dance. You lazy motherfucker. I don't want to <laughs> dance because Joe's watching. It's a nine two five. <laughs> it's a nine two five. Get on that camera because I'm gonna go bite. Somebody's head. <laughs> hey, Joe. Wait, wait, they can't see. The camera's not lined up. It will be. No! No! Rains! 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 It's amazing. You don't normally see fat zombies either. <laughs> and supposedly fat guys die fast because we can't run fast enough. Dude, you're, you're a boomer. Run. You're a boomer. Give her, give her play. Well, you're going to come eat my brains too? No. <laughs> I'm going to come get Hellgate. Colgate. You're done, Colgate. Your teeth have attracted them. <laughs> <laughs>